When getting started with the Health app, you'll want to set up a health profile and a medical ID. A health profile is just a set of basic information about you, like your sex, height, weight, and allergies if you have any. A medical ID will display similar information on the emergency screen of your iPhone or Apple Watch. This can inform first responders of any medical conditions or allergies that you have, even if you're unconscious at the time. To add or edit your health profile or medical ID, tap on the profile photo here in the upper right. If you're wondering why this image is being used here, it's going to be whatever is associated with your card in the Contacts app. So this has already picked up my name and birthday from Contacts. Tap the Edit button and I can also add my sex, blood type, skin type, which I don't know, and whether or not I use a wheelchair. If you own an Apple Watch, selecting Yes here will cause it to track wheel pushes rather than your steps. Tap Done and my basic health profile is set. Now let's do a medical ID. First responders will know to look for this if you have an iPhone or Apple Watch on you. So if you're not able to communicate with them, they will still be able to access this essential information in order to treat you. So this takes in my name and date of birth from my contacts card as well. And in the rest of these fields, I can add information on medical conditions I have, allergies, and my blood type. Another really important item here is your emergency contact. We can enter their contact information and what their relation is to me. Tap Done and the medical ID is saved. Now let's see how it can be used. So if I lock my iPhone and then view the lock screen with someone that can't unlock the phone using Face ID and then swipe up, the passcode screen will appear. In the lower left is the emergency button. And in the lower left of that screen is my medical ID with all the information that I entered for it. This can also be accessed on an Apple Watch. Just press and hold on the side button of your Apple Watch and the emergency screen appears. Swipe on the medical ID button and that information can be viewed here on the watch. One word of warning when pressing and holding the side button of an Apple Watch. If I continue to hold, a countdown will begin. When this ends, 911 or whatever the local emergency number is will be automatically contacted and your location transmitted to them. This can also be done silently with a press and hold and then a swipe on the emergency SOS button. Finally, we can register as an organ donor through Donate for Life here in the Health app. When I sign up, the only extra information I really need to enter here is the last four digits of my social security number. Tap Continue to complete the registration. Once registered as a donor here, it will also appear in your medical ID.